there is a better way to set up music loops in FMOD that does not use loop regions. Despite the name, loop regions are really not the best tool to set up music loops in FMOD. What you want to use instead are destination markers and transition regions. This setup has one main advantage. You'll be able to define a portion of audio at the beginning of your track that can be used as an introduction going into the loop section and a portion of audio at the end of your track that usually contains the reverb tail of your music. This reverb tail needs to ring out in full for a smooth transition back to the beginning of the loop. This is a feature that many thought was available only wise, where there you need to set up an intro cue marker and exit cue marker to define the boundaries of the loop. And in reality, this is also possible in FMOD, and this is one of the reasons why I wanted to make this video. So let's switch to FMOD, where I use the main menu track for the video game Blind Fade Edonoyami to demonstrate this whole setup. Let's start by adding a new 2D timeline to which we're going to add some music and a tempo marker to let FMOD know the tempo and the time signature of this composition. You also want to make sure that the FMOD timeline is set to musical mode by clicking on display beats. Since we're working with music, we want to make sure that the grid is showing bits per minute and not seconds. At this point, we are ready to start defining the loop region. We'll need to add a destination marker, which we're going to rename by double clicking on it and call it start. And a transition to this very marker that we just created. Since I wrote this music, I know that I want to start my loop at bar three. And I also know that the last bar of music for this composition, it's at bar 50. Then I need to double click on this transition to reveal the transition region, which I need to stretch to three bars, which is the length of my reverb tail. And I also need to bring in the reverb tail over the beginning of the loop to start creating the crossfade. FMOD is going to automatically add these crossfades that are played in real time. In my case, I don't need the one that fades out the reverb tail because I want it to fade out naturally, but I will add a little bit of fading on bar 3 going to bar 4. And last thing is just to test it. And that's it. Another double click on this marker will close the transition region. And this is how you set up loops in FMOD without using loop regions. Thanks for watching this video. And if you want to find out more about the video game Blind Fate Edonoyami, head to Steam where you can play a free demo and wishlist the game. Bye. <laughs>